number eight for Galway is Michael Connolly. Number nine for the Limerick man standing beside him. That is Dave Punch and the other two centre field men. Steve Mann on the left for Galway and on the right is Jimmy Carroll and the game is on and it's Jimmy Carroll. Joe Connolly in there. Leonard Enright still in there. Out to this side of the field now and it's Bernie Ford. Ford going through. And it's save a goal. A goal for Galway. Two minutes gone. Bernie Ford the kicker of that one. But chased is the word. TJ Malloy putting inside. It's a goal, it's a goal by TJ Malloy. Just watch it again now. Here he comes cutting into the centre. He throws himself to the ground. Mossy Carroll going up for it. Jimmy Carroll. A, a goal, a goal deflected. Deflected by Eamon Cregan. Eamon Cregan deflected that one. Eamon Cregan coming out through with Connor Hayes after him. What a lovely dummy he saw. What a lovely shot. What a lovely point. About 18 minutes gone in the first half. Joe Connolly. And John Connolly getting it up in his hand. He shot at a point. Connolly to Connolly. Michael Kennedy with the puck out. Galway coming into the attack again. No lane. And over the bar. Oh, what beautiful hurling by these Galway forwards. No lane from out the field on the 45 metre line, taking the chance that came his way and putting his county 2 7 to 1 5 into the lead. And there goes the half time whistle. Michael Connolly, Joe Connolly, high and over the bar, another point for Galway, Joe Connolly the scorer, out towards Brian Carroll and here comes Brian, Brian with a long ball, way up the field, Joe McKenna going through with Ron McInerney and Joe McKenna's got it, he takes his shot and it's a goal, a goal for Limerick and Joe McKenna is the scorer. Dom Punch, beaten by Bernie Ford. And Bernie racing clear now. It's high, and it's over the bar. Another point there, and a delightful point by Bernie Ford. Over the ball, Eamon Cregan, Limerick's chief scorer. He stands back to get a bit of power into the drive. Here it comes. It's out! It's a goal that went through those three strong Galway men. There's the puck, the crash and the goal. Finbar Cantley. Ball breaking out under the loose now. And a shot that's gone over the bar. Over the bar for a point there. His first shot of the game. Galway, there's the final whistle. Galway are the champions. Galway 2.15, Limerick 3.9. And look at that for excitement. It's been a long time coming, but there it is for Galway. The Shah playing as Kaga. Talk Craven here in the National Gallium. People of Galway, we love you. <laughs> so the team is then parading behind their respective captains on what is truly a tremendous national sporting occasion. John Bannon from Longford checking the watch. And the 109th All-Ireland Final gets underway. Down towards Derek Savage. Crowd roaring on their encouragement, dropping it in there towards Forrick Joyce. Joyce having this chance to put Galway ahead. And he's put it over the bar. He's such a good player. Look how deep Michael Donlan has come. On for Kevin Walsh. 
a real tearaway play this. That's a great movement. Michael Donlan right through the heart of the Kildare defence. Laying it off here for Derek Savage. Savo playing it outside to Sean Old, the player. And that has gone over the bar. Christy Byrne is objecting, but Sean Old, the player, has come forward and hit an absolutely wonderful point. Nicely taken up here by Michael Donlan. He's a terrific footballer, coming forward, looking for another score for Galway. And that's another one. He raises his arms in delight. Michael Donnellan deserved that, Creary, from a corner. This is a good situation, and that's gone over the bar. Well, it's taken 13 minutes for Kildare's first score, but Eddie McCormick finally made it. Still McCormick. Now Glenn Ryan. Again, some isolation inside there, and it's working out well. McCreary's forward, and there's support from early, and it's in. Just come. Dermot Early, the goal scorer. Michael Donnellan again, terrific footballer. Players calling for it. Ja Fallon wants it, gives a return once more to Michael Donnellan, holding up the point of the attack against Anthony Rainbow. The angle tight, the kick good, and it sails over the bar. That's the second point for Michael Donnellan. Locating Niall Buckley. Four minutes to go to the break as Graven sets up. Carol O'Dwyer looking for two in a row. He may have started quietly, but he really is now putting down a marker for the Galway back line. It is Kildare who lead. They lead by 1 5 to 5 points. And John Dibley was uh, trying to get away from his man, but uh, fouled. That's a great ball. Donnellan inside to a chance. Here's a chance. Galway showing the sky here, and they do. But it going after just four minutes of the second half. Ja Fallon. Trying to give the leadership on the 40. Quick throw of the shoulders onto the left boot. A huge one that's high and it's over the bar. Ja Fallon, second point. Well, this is among the best football that Galway has played in this year's championship. The referees and lines will be very strict on that in this particular championship. It's a big one. That's a very, very good kick. That's over the bar. This man has the look of a winner. They're convinced. And that's a third point for Ja Fallon. Donlan ahead there for Kevin Wards, looking for a next support player who is Sean O'Donnell. That's a good one. That's gone over the bar. O'Donnell did it in the semi-final. He's done it again in the final. Galway fans are celebrating already. It may be a bit premature, but they're delighted with the performance of their players in the second half, and O'Donnell's done it once again. Always a man to lift this team. Torek Brennan. Tomás Meehan has gone out after him. This is Buckley again. And that's gone over the bar. Niall Buckley, his first point of the match. He's working tirelessly. Nicely across to Ja Fallon. Nice ball ahead again from Donnellan to Neil Finnegan. Into the corner to Sean Old the player. He looks for another point and he's got another. And Galway now are surely the champions. A second point by Sean Old the player from Ankehuru Rua. Kildare coming forward. They need a goal. Buckley belting it in towards Brian Murphy. What will Brian Murphy do? Gets a fish to it off the post. Oh, that was so close. This ambitious ball in here, in towards Brian Murphy. It's hit the post, it's gone out, but it's all over. And Galway are the All-Ireland champions from 1998. Galway have won their eighth All-Ireland final, captained by Ray Silk. And including in their ranks many stars, Mick O'Dwyer trying to congratulate the opposite man. So Joe McDonough presents Sam to Ray. The West is truly awake. Galway are the All-Ireland football champions for 1998. What a day.